so welcome to the part six of this war of mine we got ourselves in a sticky situation because we managed to kill one more character and again there was little I could do it's just I risked, risked it and I failed because of that we are lacking food we didn't get any food from the last three nights so that's the main goal for now and for tonight so we're gonna end it right here and yeah he's gonna scavenge he's gonna guard and he's gonna guard I'm sorry guys but we are kind of in a desperate situation so quiet house this house is with the people in it and for me this is the safest option now and I'm going to do it I'm gonna rob everything they have and that's it let's go scavenging and I'm hoping that there is a lot of food there so let's see it I'm, I'm gonna go straight for that yes it's day 32 night 32 and I'm gonna do everything I can to survive at the moment the situation is dire fertilizer we need that and we need a lockpick probably yeah so we're gonna come here tomorrow night I need safe options right now and to be honest I, I'm, I really wanna go and deal with those bandits who killed Marco Marco was my favorite character and with him dead it, the game doesn't feel the same so I'm definitely going to try and, and have some kind of revenge okay let's go downstairs that's the only area I didn't check okay not a lot of loot here but it's enough for now water that's really important now do I have enough parts to make a lockpick no so I hope the trader comes the merchant oh I missed this one let's take it components please have components so I can make a lockpick not enough not enough but still better than nothing okay so next time I visit this place I'm gonna bring a lockpick and a hatchet and I'm gonna own that place and I need meds and bandages too don't forget your people are sick Bruno is pale he looks severely sick that is going to be our main focus at the moment severely ill oh man this is breaking my heart I know slightly wounded Yes, set the trap because we have some fertilizer. Okay, Bruno. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna eat and you're going to bed. Oh man. I hope he doesn't kick the bucket. 
I hope so. I hope so. Exit. Let's see if we have enough for a lockpick. Yeah, not enough. One more component. Okay. Go and eat. Where is our cook? Yeah, he has to eat something. those kids again but we have canned food sad and tired go to bed hungry and ill okay I need to find him some pills that's the only thing I care about right now Okay. Yeah, take it. Two cans. Sorry. Sorry guys. I have to apologize to my characters, but they are sad and they are hungry. have to deal with one thing at a time go throw some firewood and and go to bed and then we are gonna work on those mats and bandages our things okay I really want to get rid of those I need a merchant as soon as possible maybe I will go to the market tonight but I need a lockpick to access the buildings there so I'm just stuck with the normal trading with the merchants and that uh, won't pay out when this war is over I'll throw a barbecue Party. Invite all neighbors and in until we're stuffed. Yeah. No child should should ever be hungry. We just had to share food with them. Okay. Hope that helps. We gave those children some food, but I don't think they'll make it through. Anyways. Well. Maybe they will thank us one day. Okay, so slightly wounded, sad. You're gonna be on a guard duty. You're gonna sleep in bed, and you're gonna scavenge now. Some parts and weapons not going there. Some food, lots of meds. We are about to steal again. Let's prepare. herbs we can bring those herbs and trade it with them because I am not in a position to make anything so do we bring a saw or a hatchet I'm gonna bring a hatchet and let's see what happens so food and meds that's the main priority okay there is something up there and I looted that place I remember I did yeah that was expected Let's do nothing there. So this is everything I looted, and it's kind of stupid that that it's showing me again.
but I'm an optimist. Yeah, nothing, absolutely nothing. Okay, I have to keep that in mind when I'm on, on a time crunch. Let's open the door. Okay, he's gonna wake up because I ran. Water and a water filter and bullets. Now I'm gonna herbs. I can take those. Now let's run out. Let's hide. Yeah, this is gonna help. So I have to remember that a lot of parts are still here, components, and this is gonna help us build a a lockpick and we can go to that house chop things out be safe chop things up and be safe while doing it that's the main focus doing things safely okay let's go will he go to bed I don't wanna harm anybody Yeah, I think he is in bed. But he used to go here to the bed. Slowly, slowly. He won't wake up. No, that's not gonna help. Okay, here. No mats. Oh man. Slowly. Now he's there. Let's go to the other side and trade with him. Maybe he has some meds, but he needs them too. He won't budge from there. Should I steal? Let's trade. Okay. He has no mats, but he has a lot of stuff. And the only thing that is really useful Maybe I can make mats at home. We have all the components for it. I reckon we do. Let's give him two bullets, no, he doesn't want bullets nope not interested, okay, I'm gonna loot him right in front oh, oh, sorry about that I'm taking all the wrong stuff Food, definitely, definitely, definitely. Water, definitely. We don't need sugar. Nope. More bullets. Thank you. 
Okay, herbs. A lockpick. That's gonna come in handy. Food, but still no meds. Okay. No. I should have ran. Ugh. I'm definitely failing at this game at the moment. Yeah, I should have ran. I don't know. I just stood there and I thought he wouldn't do a thing. But yeah, he did. Okay, so we are gonna go there tonight. And we are gonna take our stuff. And then we are gonna see what can we do there. I'm gonna go there with the gun. Nothing else. This is a dire situation at the moment. You're gonna sleep in bed. They cannot steal a thing from us. We're gonna scavenge and we are gonna prepare with the gun. Four bullets should be enough. Let's go. Everything is going bad again. Again, a simple mistake. Well, that's what happens when you're playing this game first time. These things happen. Oh, and did he just go away? Oh, man. He did. I could have looted him. Okay, take my stuff. Bullets. Weapon parts. A crowbar. This is all we can take. Let's see if he has meds here. Oh, that's the food. And that's what we need. So. I'll take the food. I don't want to kill anybody yet. he doesn't have what we need day 35 everything is barren okay still lacking meds but we have food yeah oh don't talk about smoking when you're sick okay no more fuel now get up you ah no 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 and if we s he, if he stands, yeah, we can bring him food. This is way easier. Ok. 
Okay, you should go and make some firewood if it's possible from something. Or maybe I can chop one bed up. Now we can burn books. I won't do that. Yeah, we have to chop one bed up. Desperate times call for desperate measures. I just hope we get a lot of... No, that's... That's so not worth it. But we have to keep... Oh, wait, wait, it's warm inside. Oh, yeah, yeah. The winter has gone. It's gone. Uh, there, it's not cold anymore. And there is food there. So good. Let's end the day. Okay. I'm I'm gonna get meds for our cook. You're gonna guard. And you're gonna scavenge. And everything is open. I'm going to the central square. But we are looking for meds. Supermarket. Summer meds. possible trade now if I go here I reckon we can trade some things and I'm gonna build and bring everything I can one lockpick let's bring one can of food one wedgies let's bring this Let's bring three of these, gun powder, and weapon parts. Yeah. Now let's let's go trade. That's the only thing coming in my mind at the moment because the cook Bruno was sick for a while now, and I'm not gonna let him die like that. Come on, somebody. No, these are trading materials. Nope, not interested. Mets. Can I clean wounds with this? Okay. Trader, merchant. Alcohol. We can use it. Matt's not interested, and I should have checked. But okay. Medical supplies. Boyana. Okay, we are gonna take pills, and we are gonna take bandages, and we are gonna give, give food. A lockpick. A diamond. Okay, she's gonna take everything. Okay, we can keep the lockpick. Or can we keep the canned food? At the no, 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 no. She's gonna do it like this. I can't shake the feeling these are very important okay deal take it now we do have a lockpick so since we are here and our backpack is really empty okay he has food not interested let's trade this for water Let's let's use that lockpick and see what's happening here. Okay, a lot of mice, rats, and their 
there's somebody up there. But he is... Okay, let's close the door. I'll get some air. Okay, let's wait for him to go in. This is probably a rat. Nah, oh man, this is huge. A lot of things to loot, probably. This, he's taking his sweet, good time. Now, if this is a person, I'm just straight turning back and running. Will he move? Yeah. Did he just lock the door? What? What? Come on, man. Ah. Uh, Well, that was unexpected. There was no chance for me to do anything there. If I went in with him standing there, that would be the end of me. He would see me and there was no time to go in because as soon as I unlocked it... Okay, outbreak of crime. Whatever that means. Okay, where is our Bruno? Let's help him out. Let's feed him first. Let's feed him. And then oh, let's bandage him up. Trading was a good idea. That merchant had everything I need. And if I did that in the first place, maybe Marco would be alive. And now just go and just go and rest. Oh yeah, let's reset the traps if it's possible, but we do have a lot of raw meat, so we are going to do that. And yeah, managing two guys is a bit easier than four, but I reckon I'm more susceptible to robberies. And yeah, I can scavenge less things now. So books or wood? Wood. Okay, let's cook. Damn it, I wish somebody would join me now. I don't want to end the game with you guys alive. I managed to kill three people. And that happened so fast. And he's slightly sick. What? I didn't see that. No. I need more meds. It doesn't get easier, does it? Let me take a look. Can we make meds? No, no we can't. Actually we can only make cigarettes and I'm gonna do it. 
because he is sad and he wants to smoke. Our things. So we got a lot of tools. So I'm probably gonna go to that house and lock pick the last door. And that's a shot in the dark because who knows what will we find there. I am looking for meds, so maybe if there isn't any on the entrance screen, I'm gonna skip it. Okay, let's end the day. Okay, everything is unlocked now. No, I'm not going to the central square again because I don't want to waste any more lockpicks. No, Vila. No. Where was it? Was it this? This was it. But I don't see the points. The point going here. Just some weapons and parts. Nah. Supermarket. Some meds. Some parts. No. Quiet house. Nothing here. So square. Hospital. Food and meds. And you're gonna guard, and you're gonna scavenge, and foo. Danger. Small apartment building. Do I wanna risk it? Let's risk it. Small apartment building it is. Let's bring a crowbar and a lockpick. I mean, it's an apartment building. Now let's see what happens. Okay, this seems precarious. Alcohol, okay. I'm a little drunk. Okay, he's gonna go to sleep. Close the door behind you. Fine, let's go. Now, one thing I'm looking in the kitchen. One thing I'm looking for is the kitchen. That's the only thing I want. Okay, he's tired. Where will his bed be? Okay, let's open the door. And what is he doing there? Okay, I can see a gun. Let's see where is he going. A bit windy tonight. Okay. move to the other side I don't like it let's go up let's see what's happening here I can't hear anybody so let's loot okay somebody is coming let's hide Okay, he's standing there. 
So I can probably loot. No, 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 run, hide. Okay, did he see me? Okay. Oof. I'm not coming back here. Where will he stand? How did he see me? How didn't he see me? Run, 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 run. Oh no, that connected. I have to stop taking these huge risks. Day 37. That didn't help him. The match did not help him. should just go to bed again. No, 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 no. The cook. Now let's cook something. Like, I am in a dire need for meds. I'm so focused on it. And it's hurting my game. Okay, let's cook. Soup should help a bit when they are sick. Okay, the merchant is here. So we want more meds. And I'm prepared to give like everything for them. Everything that I have. And he has just these. Which are sh ah, I don't wanna curse. Food, consumables. I'll take the sugar. Take the little gears. Take these parts. Take these parts. I'm gonna keep the alcohol because I can probably make something. And so herbs. Let's take these herbs. And what else? Yeah. Deal. Bye bye. We're good with the food. So yeah, let's let's try to make some meds or something now I know for a fact that these won't help our cook but maybe they can help oh no pure alcohol we need pure alcohol 
but maybe they can help Marn because he's just slightly sick and that's ensure that ensures me that at least one guy will be fine okay go to bed and we will figure this out And yeah, it did help him. No, no, it didn't. She's sleeping bad, and he's gonna scavenge. So small apartment building is off the table. Huge amounts of meds. Danger. Military outpost, danger, hospital, caution. Let's go to the hospital. I think caution is better than danger, I guess, because maybe church. Maybe the, the Pope will trade something good with me hospital it is I'm not bringing anything because I'm not planning to fight I would rather run away without looting anything and survive than to just die and stay with one guy whoa 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 This guy. Okay, I won't do anything stupid. Relax. Yeah, I'm. I'm hoping that he won't attack me. Okay, that's fine. Now the only thing I'm interested in. Is are the meds and he is standing in my way getting them this is my chance this is my chance holy grail holy grail Grab all, exit, 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 loot this. Oh yeah. Trash. Okay. Food. Now, are, is everybody here okay with me? He's still smoking. Is he finished? Yeah, he's finished. Okay. Uh, so he wants medicine and bandages. And I am not interested. Not at all. Okay. Can I take a peek? Okay. Let's see what's up here. This is a wounded guy. Let's just see what's here. And now we can loot this stuff. No, we can't because. Oh! Let's see what. What's this? Oh, we should bring our. our sick guy. Here, yeah. That's fine. Let's go upstairs. No, no, no. Now let's loot it. 
grab all. Act like nothing happened. Nothing happened here. Now we should bring our wounded guy here. He could use her help. No, I won't. I'm just chilling. I'm gonna check this bed out. I'm gonna grab some sugar and then I'm gonna wait. But the time is running out. I'm not messing with you. Chill out, man. Can we go through here? Okay, we can loot this. This is not private property. And we can loot... Okay, he's gonna sleep. And she is gonna see me. Nothing. Okay, let's go here. Okay, I'm feeling really comfortable here. This guy can help me. Can he help me? Okay. So we're definitely gonna bring Bruno. What's happening here? Okay, he's just chilling. Let's go downstairs. If you get worse. Anything here? No. Okay, okay, I'm not interested. I'm gonna loot this in front of their faces. Now I'm gonna loot this. left to loot yeah I can loot can we loot he's gonna see me okay run run this was a good run now tomorrow night we are gonna bring our sick guy here and he's gonna get healed hopefully if he survives and I'm worried he won't I'm just hoping I see him on the stairs where he usually is when I come back oh my god nowhere to be found okay he's alive Whew. let's bring him some some meds first let's bring him some soup why can't I help him kind of feeling better he can run now okay meds meds and he's and Marin is no longer sick which is epic now I think we will pull this off Mets, go to bed rest now, Martin is gonna eat a can of food. And I... Yeah, you can feel bad as much as you want, but we are gonna survive this. Now, I'm thinking just to stay in tonight.
but the temperature is low again so maybe firewood again this is it I'm gonna end the day yeah you're gonna sleep in bed and you're gonna guard and you're gonna stay in I need him to get better so he can guard we have been raided Bruno is feeling much better we just had to keep an eye on him good what's our ammunition status six I'm gonna stay in one more day now go eat a can of food that's the best thing to do at the moment the temperature is looking good I'm not forced to get firewood so let's repeat the same thing now you should go and he's slightly wounded ah probably from the last night but he was sleeping so that's weird take the meds it's a 50-50% chance that they will help you and let's see if we can make a soup yes we can yeah make a soup drink it feel better you're gonna be as good as new for tonight's guarding duty yeah that trip to the hospital was a good call and I, I noticed this one but I don't have any more fertilizer so when we wake up so sick on meds sleep in bed guard stay day 40 again he's still feeling much better so good sick recovering hungry and tired let's take these and put some raw meat inside yeah okay and then we need water to cook so cooking is at the table for now but we are gonna use our water collector because it's not winter at the moment and we can do that but we don't have the components maybe we can make it from the things we have I'm not sure nope nope so chill bio I took some useful stuff from the hospital. Can they manage without it? They can. Okay, he wants to exchange. I'm gonna run to him. Wake up, wake up, go. Exchange. Let's get more bullets. We are not leaving the house. We are gonna barricade ourselves in and wait until we run out of food and then we're gonna go and steal some more yeah let's make a deal what you got what you got I don't need it don't need it don't need it don't need it I was gonna make some meds but we can make tobacco out of them and our boy is gonna feel much better so water for cooking cans one is enough let's buy some of these 
five is enough. And let's give them herbs. Oh, he wants a lot of them. Okay. I'm giving back my herbs. Hmm. Yeah. Deal. Now, get the hell out of my porch. Bye bye. So, let's cook. Let's burn some books. Two guys, five books. We have too much books. Two guys, three books. I hope I didn't burn their favorite book. That would cause severe depression. That would depress me if somebody burned my favorite book. I start to panic when I can't find my favorite book. And I don't stop until I... Uh, uh, no. I nearly ate too much. Okay cook, wake up, go eat, and rest. Now I should go to the garage where my my fast runner died, Pavle, and take those items. I'm afraid there will be one more one more winter or something like that and I'm gonna need wood again let's end it so Bruno is still sick now hospital is 35% explored now we can go Villa, no, 22, hotel, no, supermarket, supermarket is quite safe, but I don't remember what I need to bring to, to explore it, I, I think I need a lockpick or something like that, now, weapons and parts, and I need a lockpick for that, and here I have to to steal and there are lots of meds or hospital you are gonna guard and you're gonna scavenge prepare we don't need a lockpick let's go let's go I hope this wasn't a mistake maybe I should just stay in now how will they treat me I'm coming back as a different guy a di different character so there is no chance they can recognize me why 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 are they attacking me That's weird. Has robbed us lately. Okay. So I guess I should have waited for him. Okay, let's talk to the nurse. Maybe she can help me. Let me help you. Good. I'm still gonna loot you.
is totally stupid what I'm doing right now. I'm probably gonna get shot again. If you get worse, I'll be here to help you. Thank you. this in the corner I'm gonna wait for her to leave now there was a guy down there was okay he's a medic okay let's get in close the door fine let's loot That's gonna come in handy. Let's close the door. Now this is fun looting like this and not getting shot at this is fun and interactive but going in and just getting wrecked right away I don't like that there is oh there is just a little room for mistakes no room for mistakes not little no Okay, I'm running from him. Okay, let's go up top. Okay, this guy won't budge from here. coming this way I'm gonna run to the exit why are you shooting at me man what what I'm done oh my god I was like ah oh, dude One guy to the end. This is a sad, sad playthrough. Our things. Yeah, so he's gonna just chill and wait it out. I reckon I can finish it like this. I have enough supplies. I can get firewood from, from breaking items. Guard, stay. I hope somebody joins me. I don't want to finish the game like this. Martin got slightly wounded. Okay, that puts a twist on it. If I leave the house, they're gonna rob me, and that's not a good idea. So I'm just gonna stay in our things 
I'm out of bullets. That's the second problem. So, can I make a knife? No. I'm still gonna stay in. And I'm just hoping I survive until the end of the war. Day 43. Okay, the day was calm. I like calm days. Can we cook something? Nope. We are out of everything. So let's eat. I'm just hoping somebody would join me. I'm gonna go and loot when the time is right, when I run out of food. So they can't steal anything. Day 44. Oh my god. They are... Well, I'm gonna leave it like this because they can't steal it, I reckon. He is hungry. Now, I'm just trying to survive until the end of the game. How long should it be? I'm expecting 50 days. It's been a long time. And the temperature is really nice. Curb on crime. Okay. So we have medicine. So we're gonna take it. And it's minus five. What? Just like that? We have to chop some things up. This bed is going. Oh man, from four people to one guy who is sick, wounded and hungry. And it all started with Marco is dead. Okay, let's chop one bed up. Okay, someone's at the door. I brought you something. Oh man, I thought it was a new character that can help us. Playing with one is really hard. If I go scavenging, they will just rob me blind. So, yeah, thank me with coffee. Thank you. Yeah, bye bye. I'm a grumpy old man. I just wanna sleep. Oh, it's cold, it's cold. We can't sleep. We can't sleep, we have to break the bed. And make a fire. That chair is probably gonna go too. 
And I should break this thing. Let's make firewood. You know what? I'm just gonna go to the garage to collect some firewood. Tonight. If they rob me, they can rob me. I don't care at this point. We have food for two days in the traps. I don't think they will steal from the traps. spots you stealing in the hospital it's over for you you won't be welcome any anytime soon or ever again even if you come with different characters that's it for you oh my god it's so cold zero oh eleven the war is over we survived in the nick of time well one guy survived and yeah helping each other we helped a man get medication for his father they ate difficult choice we robbed a defenseless elderly couple Tough de decision. Marco robbed someone. Talking, almost e took taking everything, almost everything they had. Sorry about that. Katya died. That was a terrible moment. Saving life. Our neighbor's children asked us for medication for her. We shared the little we had with them. Good. Neighbors in need. Our friendly neighbors came to ask us for help in reinforcing their shelter we were happy to help them difficult choice we robbed the man and his sick father Marco died Marco was killed while looking for supplies hungry children the children we had helped earlier came to ask us for some food we shared with them nice Pavel died. Pavel was killed while looking for supplies. Bruno died. Bruno was killed while looking for supplies. And peace. Ceasefire. The long-awaited ceasefire finally came into force, eventually putting an end to fighting in Pogren. Those who managed to survive the war, and I didn't get it. Marin cheated death again and saw the end of fighting. Although he remained plagued by the survivor's guilt, he set about rebuilding his life and soon he was running a small repair business again. He kept the action figure on his workbench but never found the courage to look for his, its previous owner. Katya never found her parents. Marco was rewarded with a shallow grave. Sadly, Pava died. Will his family come back to Pogren to visit his grave one day, or would it be too painful? I a reminder of what they had gone through. Do the dead men, do the dead even care? Despite his valiant struggle, Runa didn't make it through the war. The fate of his friend he was worried about remains unknown. So all in all a good game. A good game a little bit hard when you play it the first time but I managed to beat it barely. I'm planning to do it again and then I'm gonna try to beat it with all the characters alive because I made 
those little mistakes that count and those were the mistakes in finesse of the gameplay just not knowing the difference bef uh, in between the the caution and the danger and for example Bruno my cook died in the hospital the last character that died if I knew how the the soldiers soldiers would treat me when I go there the second time I would never go there there were, there was no need for me to go there there was no u usable items so basically he died for nothing the same thing goes and that I would avoid definitely the same thing goes for Katya I was not ready for that guy to like destroy me on the start and I had weapons if I had weapons with me that guy would die and she would live so that just not knowing what awaits you in the second the second time I play the game if I play it I'm gonna go there with a shovel and I'm gonna wreck his face and Marco yeah that that was a a greedy that I could have saved Marco you know and I didn't even know I managed to hide the guy went out as soon as I popped out of the shadow the guy saw me so yeah I won't do that the next time so I reckon all of my four deaths was just the noobishness because I didn't know what will happen I wasn't ready for it now I am ready and I could probably storm through this game but I had a, a beginners experience and it was epic I enjoyed it it's really fun and immersive at the times when I was like robbing people and stealing from good people you could you feel bad about it it's not just like an out of body experience and you don't feel anything you feel the guilt and they say uh, they show you they are sad they are depressed because they done that but then you help other people out and that's that like cancels it out and you know I killed one guy two guys and one guy was totally innocent and he did attack me but he was like not a bandit or a soldier and I killed him and I regret that and I regret not killing those soldiers that killed Marco and I wish I had the chance to do it but it was not feasible I didn't want to lose any more characters but if I play this game again I'm definitely going to play it a lot better but for the first time I'm glad I completed it so yeah thank you for watching and I am planning to do the sequel to this game the sequel to this war of mine and that's gonna be the next thing on my schedule so yeah thank you for watching and see you next time